How's it going, YouTube? This is Polka Penguin here, and today we get to open the Shining Legends Elite Trainer box. This is, uh, I've been waiting to do this. I've been waiting to get through my midterms to actually open this up, and they are done. So I'm just, uh, I'm gonna open this up. I really want to. Oh. This set has already been one of the most fun that I've opened. And I can't wait to just keep going with it. So we're going to slide this out. Okay, so multiple steps. Where's the... Ah, here it is. So here we've got the, the poster. So you got the different pack cards. Always cool. That will be going up on my wall. Here we've got the booklet. So it tells you some, some things. And then you got the... Uh, the set list. It's pretty cool. Just gonna leaf through it. Some of these are pretty cool cards. It's nice that it's a small set. Um, so I'm I'm happy about that. Uh, let me just quickly grab something because I forgot to set up my sleeves and all that. I apologize. Okay, and then here we go. Take the box off. We got different things of cardboard. So we got packs. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ah, and ten. Also got our energy. Uh, let's do these. Uh, four, four dividers. Different views of Ho-Oh. TCGO code. Uh, dice, which someone pointed out earlier that this actually looked like Lugia, and I thought that was really cool, considering it's a Ho-Based set. Got these sleeves. These sleeves look slick. Don't think I'm going to... I think I'm going to keep one sealed, just like the Generations. Um, definitely got these. And something that my friend Albuquerque505 pointed out, this box isn't completely flat. So instead of... You can see it here. Instead of this, maybe if it'll focus. Instead of having the little circle, it's a whole thing. And I actually like that design a lot more. And of course, we have... Actually, I'm gonna... Carefully... I have another ETB, so I feel comfortable taking this out. Here we go. If we can focus. Shining Ho-Oh. You can see the texture. Um... Let's get this in a sleeve, and you can see here promo number 70, and just for comparison's sake, because I want to do this, here you've got the, the Japanese and then the English promo. It's pretty cool. It's the, something I could do since I, or something I would do since I had the capability of doing it, but enough of that let's let's get this in a sleeve though because it's beautiful Ooh. and here we've got our 10 packs um, I'm just gonna quickly three okay so it looks like we'll be doing this order get Mewtwo out of the way first because it is not shiny that's how I like to do this. Uh, let's lower this. Here we got Mewtwo. Ooh. Oh, this this pack is uh, it's a shredding. Is it this way? Yeah. Okay. One, two, three, four. One, two. Let's get that out. And here we have Jinx, Ivysaur. Shroomish, Totodile, Bulbasaur, Psychic Energy, Carnivine, Ultra Ball, Damage Mover, Reverse Hollow for Alligator, it's pretty cool, and Zekrom Hollow. Um, actually, I'm gonna quickly grab this. For all the hollows that I already have, they're going in a penny sleeve. 
So that'll go off to the side. And on to the next pack. Okay. One, two, three, four. One, two. Here we have Zorua, Buizel, Plusle, Torcat, Scraggy, Fairy Energy, Spirit Tomb, Golurk, Energy Retrieval, Reverse Hollow Zekrom, I already have that one too, and a Mewtwo GX. Awesome. Do not have this card yet. This is actually the first GX from the set for me. Take a quick look. I like how the the mirror the the uh, the GX pattern works with like Mewtwo and mo moving around it as a psychic type, if that makes sense. But that's really cute, really cool. Excuse me. On to our third Mewtwo pack. One, two, three, four. One, two. Here we have Litten, Purloin, Voltorb, Golet, Boizel, uh, Psychic Energy, Carnivine, Ultra Ball, Ooh, Damage Mover. I think those were the same three that I had in the first pack. Reverse Hollow Sophocles, and a Manaphy Hollow. Also a duplicate. I think the nice thing about having a like a hollow in each pack, aside from the like the the code card that doesn't actually matter, is that it'll keep prices low for those who can't spend the money for uh, for all the products, and they can buy a hollow set real cheaply. On to Shining Genesects. That, that's just my opinion. I know as a collector it's worth less, but I still think that it's it's nice. It's a nice touch. But here we've got Shroomish, Totodile, Bulbasaur, Pikachu, Stunfisk, Grass Energy, Pokemon Catcher, Great Ball, Scrafty, Reverse Hollow Jinx, Ooh, yes, and a Shining Jirachi. Let's see if I can move this up just a little bit. You can see the texture a little bit. But that is... Ooh, I will gladly take a Shining, even a duplicate. Oh, that is beautiful. I love the way that they did this, um, the Shining pattern again. Get that. So that should be one, two, three, four, five, six. This is halfway. This is the halfway point, and it's still so much fun. One, two, three, four, one, two. Here we have Torkoal, Ivysaur, Quillfish, Shroomish, Litten, uh, Fighting Energy. Nope, that's a Psychic Energy. I apologize. Pokemon Catcher, Lipard, Alligator, Reverse Hollow is an Arbok, and an Eveltal Hollow. First one of these. No, that one. Pretty cool. On to the last of the shiny Genesex pack arts. That way. One, two, three, four, one, two. Torcat. Breloom. Minum. My, my nun, excuse me, Larvesta, Torkoal, Dark Energy, Super Scoop Up, Fur Alligator, Incineroar, Golette, and Verzion, another uh, hollow that I needed. Also, quick. Quick shout out to Incineroar with the the changed name. Just gonna just gonna put that out there. On to you know what? I'm gonna change it up. We're gonna do Shiny Rayquaza first. 
Why? Because, jeez. Oh, Why not? Okay. This, here we go. Let's do it from the bottom. There we go. It's a little mangled, but that's quite all right. One, two, three, four, one, two. And we have a Torcat, Totodile, Weasel, Pikachu, Bulbasaur, Fire Energy, Incineroar, Pokemon Catcher, Super Scoop Up, Reverse Hollow Electrode, and another Revolt Hollow. So, nothing new out of that one, but that's okay. Still got three to go. This set is just, I don't know, it's so much fun to open. I can't wait for all the other product that this, uh, that comes with Shining Legends, or that Shining Legends comes with, I should say. Just because there's so many, like, unconventional uh, as to what I'm used to. Like, normally you expect all the all the nice cards to have have textures that you feel if you put your hands the right place when you move the cards around, but it's like... The Shining Pokemon don't have that. You can't feel it, and it looks like a normal card. So it's it's a really nice um, it's a really nice aspect in my in my mind because it just it takes or like not having not having that or actually like having those qualities in this set makes it a lot easier to be genuinely surprised when you pull. A nice shining card. One, two. Here we've got Breloom, Voltorb, Litten, Purloin, Zorua, Fighting Energy, Lily, Volcarona, Golurk, Reverse Help Golette, and a Shaman. This is first Shaman, so you get a nice sleeve. Pretty cool. On to the last pack. Let's hope I can get some third nice pull out of 10 packs. That would be great. Here we go. We've got a Litten, Zorua, Quillfish, Shroomish, Golette, Lightning Energy, Scrafty. How, Warp Energy, Reverse Hollow Quillfish, and a Latios Regular Hollow. So, I mean, that's a little disappointing. Um, just because I've seen some really, really amazing, really, really amazing pulls from uh, Elite Trainer Boxes. But, yeah, we still got some good stuff. So, we will do a quick recap. We got Verizian Hollow, Giveltal Hollow, Zekrom Hollow, Manaphy Hollow, another Giveltal Hollow, another Manaphy Hollow, Shaman Hollow, Latios Hollow, oops, sorry, Mewtwo GX, Shining Jirachi, and of course, the Shining Ho-Oh promo. So, thank you for watching. Um, let me know if you've opened one of these or multiple of these. Let me know down below how they've turned out for you. Uh, this seems a little lackluster compared to other ones that I've seen. But, um, I mean, Shining Jirachi, definitely worth it. And again, I have one more that I'm going to open up that hopefully will be, uh, will be better. But, yeah, thank you for watching.